Hey everybody, welcome back to Ask Pete. This week we're actually doing a market update for the first quarter of 2022. Woo! We're starting to see some shifts taking place in our local market. So I wanted to share an update on what's been happening since the start of the year. As you might expect, the number of homes on the market heading into the holiday season in December goes down significantly. And this is because everyone kind of shifts their focus to having some quiet time with friends and family, and many people decide to put their real estate needs on pause. And this is actually really clear when you look at Google searches for real estate topics, it really drops in December. And you also notice in this graph just how quickly it comes roaring back in January. So even though we were still living through some lockdown measures, people on the hunt for their next home were anxious to get their search back underway in the new year. This meant when that first home hit the market, there were a lot of motivated buyers who jumped on the opportunity. A good example is actually one of the first homes that hit the market in St. Lazare. They received at least 20 offers and had about 75 visits. After that, what we saw is that each subsequent home that hit the market kind of had a little bit less and less. There are a few key factors at play here. First, as all these homes continue to get sold, it represents one less buyer each time. And secondly, Recent interest rate hikes have an impact on affordability for buyers as well. In other words, higher interest rates means higher monthly payments for the same price home, which reduces the number of potential buyers at each price point. And third, with the rate of inflation driving up the cost of many regular living expenses, many buyers are considering holding off on their purchase plans until there's more certainty on just how much of an impact this is gonna have. With all this said, we are still seeing what can only be defined as a seller's market. Homes are still receiving multiple offers and prices are continuing to climb. However, what I've actually been noticing myself in the last few weeks is we're seeing some signs or maybe some very early signs of the market cooling off ever so slightly. Let's now take a look at some of the numbers showing what has happened in our market since the start of 2022. If we look at median sale price in 2021 versus 2022 for St. Lazar, Hudson, and Vaudreuil, we can see a significant increase in price. Thank you so much for joining us for our market update. As usual, if you have any more questions about the market, you'd like to know more about some of the statistics, what's happening in your area, you can contact me anytime.